Okay, this will be a funny one. Normal, I've done heaps of these. Let's see if we can make this look good. Okay, flash the badges and we're off. Come on, Konica. Oh, fuck you. They're a bit, bit rough with the buttons. Not that rough, not rough as in damage the buttons, but a little bit clumsy. Even though this is a piece of shit, I'm not interested in getting rough with it. It's just not what I am about, even though it's shit. You've got to acknowledge it's shit, but that doesn't mean that you treat it with, with contempt. Uh, mainly the contempt I give to this equipment is verbal. Verbal abuse. That's where I get where I do most of my... Uh, <laughs> maybe my damage is verbal. It's nothing more, very little... There's, anything physical is, is an accident, so it's just verbal abuse. You can get hear my language, it can get quite uh, torrid at times. So yeah, very torrid, angry, hot, cranky. Foul language is what I was meant to imply with torrid. Maybe torrid's the wrong term, I don't know. Do I really fucking care? No. Let's see what we can do with this shit, this piece of... Tajay, Tajay. So yeah, I, I don't know whether I showed it to you properly, but this is what we're photocopying today on this. It's Tajay, piece of Tajay, a pamphlet of Tajay, or Target as it's actually called, but I just love to call it Tajay. <laughs> a lot of people do actually, it's not just me. But anyway, we've made this Tajay look pretty good. Look at that. That's really good. That's a really good start. So we're going to make this the centre of our job. And we're going to make this piece of shit, this piece of commercial fuck. We're going to just consign it to the recycle pile. It's done its dash. Uh, now we're just going to set this silly thing up to finish the job. Uh, right. I'm just going to make this look good. I'm going to make this Tajay shit. I'm going to leave it like that. Maybe the contrast could go to the centre. And we're just going to maybe enlarge it. We're going to just change these settings here. So we're going to call it 104 by 104. So we're going to call it that. And we're just going to get our piece that we've made. We're going to put it on the glass and make something out of it. So... So let's see if we can make this look good. So we're just going to overlap the edges. So this is that side. This side's going up that way. So we're just going to wrestle it onto the edge of the glass. So yeah, this is just a typical uh, Tajay pamphlet. <laughs> I like calling it Tajay. It's good to take the piss out of a big multinational. I think it's a multinational or a I'm pretty sure they're an American concern, but they've been in Australia for decades. For a long time since I remember. Don't know how long since I... It's been there... I know it's been there more than 30 years. It's a huge company. Uh, and I think it's American. I remember seeing a movie which featured a Target store, and it was called Career Opportunities. So if you want to watch a movie that was shot in a Target store which it talks about, it, you know, it's a real thing I like about that movie is that they actually use the name Target and it's a real, it gives it a more authentic flavour. Uh, even though Target is a, a huge money-fucking uh, corporation, uh, it's still nice, it was still fun to see the, see a couple of um, teenagers in the movie let loose in a Target store. They were locked up. The, the plot is about... A couple of kids that got locked up in a Tajay store. So look it up, career opportunities. It's more like a B-grade movie rather than a huge holiday box box office hit. Uh, but it was funny. It's it's humorous to find that they're in a Target store. So yeah, career opportunities. That was a funny movie. That was a bloody funny movie. I don't know why it was called Career Opportunities. Uh, for some reason, that's what that, I, I forgot the exact plot. I just know that there were two people locked up in a Target store. This was in America. So let's see if we can make this Target shit look any good. OK. 
Okay. Just a bit shaky, folks. Uh, that's that one there. And, oops, it's a little crooked. Sorry, folks, about that. Try and straighten it. It's not easy to straighten these up. A the bit of curling makes it a little bit more difficult. Although it's not that badly curled in this case. It's a bit crooked on this one. Anyway, there's our Tajay composition. I think that looks really good. Gotta go.